that. <laughs> now slow down now. Don't hurt yourself now. <sighs> Dad, don't hurt yourself. <laughs> You're still important to me. You. Come on. Slow that now. Come on, Dad. Oscar. You don't have the lungs anymore, Oscar. Dad. Oscar. Dad, what? Oscar, look at your father. Your father is fit. That you're not as I strong am as anymore. fit as fiddle. Ah, uh, come on! <laughs> I hear you. <laughs> we, we can just we can walk back to the palace. I'm, I'm stronger than you think, Oscar. I, I agree with you, Father. Eh? Let's just keep working. Want us to run again? Dad, you don't you don't have the lungs for this anymore. You're you're getting old. <laughs> Bella! Oh my god! It's been ages. Where have you been? I'm fine. Oh, so good to see you. Good to see you too. Oh my goodness. How are you? Oh, okay, how are you? I'm good. Wow. Um, good morning, sir. Yeah. Um, okay, quick one. This is my friend Mandy. And Mandy, this is my friend Oscar from oh, wow. way back. Nice to meet you too. What are you two doing in this town? Well, we serve in this town. Oh, okay. Yeah. And what are you doing here? Oh, I'm the prince of this town. That's a joke, right? I'm serious. That's my father, the Igwe. You're joking. Yeah, so we're, we're doing our morning run. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Oh. See, my father. Oh, wow. Yeah. Nice to meet you. What a pretty one. <laughs> Igwe. Yeah, how are you, girl? How are you? Well. Yeah. My God. Pretty one. Yeah, she's beautiful. Yeah. Mandy, Mandy yeah. right? Yeah. My name is Mandy. Wow. See, 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 you girls. Uh, uh, how, how many kilometers have we done? How many? Well, about two, Dad. No, 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 no. Oscar, I did three before you joined me. So I've done five kilometers that way, right? Wow. That, that's not true. Running, I mean. I, I can match you girls step for step. Yeah. Really? Yeah. There you go again, Dad. There you go again. Dad. This way! No, 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 that way. I've done five kilometers there. This way. This way? Ready? Anyway. This way is going that way. Oh! Come on, come on! Yeah! 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 Are this too serious? That's your friend, yeah? Yeah. What? I'm just just looking at her. Huh? Well, I uh, will talk to her about it if you want me to. Please, come on, talk to her. Right? Let her know how I feel about her. And this is what you call, you know, love at first sight. I, do. Oh. I spotted her. I just, I don't know. My system just shut down. <laughs> hey, Oscar. What? what? Tell me you don't have a woman in your life, and I'll tell you it's a lie. Admit you just want to have a fling. Come on, I don't it's want to me. Have a fling, come on, Bella. You know me by now. I want something really serious. I mean, I'm not getting any younger. If she agrees to be my woman, I could just make her my wife. 
I like her. Look at her. She's, you know, she's just full in the right places. Uh. <laughs> well, I don't believe you, but for the purpose of this conversation, I'm just going to pretend like I believe you, okay? And we'll see. I'll try my best. So when are you going to talk to her? When they run back. No, we don't have to wait for them to run back. We can just meet them up. Come on, let's go. Oh, like, you will we'll, we'll do the talking when we get there. Come on. Ichi, good morning, sir. Uh, good morning, my daughter. How are you? I am fine, sir. Ichi, the king has gone for a road walk along with his son, the prince. Hey, Igwe and this is road walk. I, I hope he wouldn't fall one day. Well, I have to be going. When he comes back, tell him that I came. Okay, sir. I'll come back later another day. You underestimated me. Now tell me, what, what else will I do to prove to you that this man here is, is fit? <laughs> He's moving. I am not doubting you, but you need to rest. You're obviously overworked. You should rest. <laughs> ah, I can see that. Uh, I can see that you are. You're a caring girl. Oh, I'm yes, yes. yes. <laughs> huh? Fit for a housewife. Um, Mandy, can I have a word? Right now? Yeah, right about now. Um, excuse us, sir. Yeah. I'll be right back. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What? I mean, uh, how did it go? How did it go now? For who? For, for you or for me? For you. Listen, I go after what I want. I mean, I'm not in for any other heartbreak again. What is the on. ego I want? Well, Oscar is a nice guy, don't you think? Oh, please. He can keep his niceness to himself. If you want to talk to me about someone, he should be the ego. This man here is a good man, and you know that. Uh, what your daddy needs is. My daughter, girl. I mean, that person. I mean, look at him. He's rich and he's the king. Come on, look at Oscar. No, no, Oscar, please. I mean, I don't want some, some fine guy that I'll have to be fighting for his attention from other ladies. You know what I mean, right? These girls, all they want now is money, 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 money. You know, I'm happy, you know. But then stop thinking of women at your age that you will never change. Well, let's, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> well, Mandy, I hope you're um, making the right Come decision. Come off it. You are also cute. Why don't you go for him? As for me. Yeah. Hi. 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 <laughs> oh, you really? Yeah. Mandy, so where are we seeing Buddha? Oh, anytime. I'm just a call away. <laughs> right. We we'll, would we'll like to see you again. <laughs> All of right. Course. So, uh, yeah. Sure. I will. Do I. Uh, do I get your number? Of course. Why not? <laughs> Why not? <laughs> oh, wow. Uh. 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 I want to keep this. Here. Hold on. What are you doing in my room with your books? Uh, uh, uh. Rose, do you still ask me this kind of question? I thought we had finalized everything in the village. You're mad. Huh? You are mad. Also, do you you want to share a room with me? As hmm. what? See, also, do you are looking for my trouble? You are really looking for my trouble. Leave you're my looking room. for your trouble, how? Also, do, get out of my room. I don't understand you. Listen, let me tell you. you this thing you are looking for, you see it too. Yes, you will see it too. Also, do I said get out of my room. Now. I should get out from your room. Get out of my room. You are pushing my box. When I have come for us to share the room as we are agreed in the village, 
Everybody agree that you are going to remarry me. Listen, let me tell you. You will understand, have to understand that I'm your, I'm your late husband, younger brother. Mm. And if you're not going to marry me, you leave this house. You leave this family. Oh, and you must marry me. Get out. Oh, so you leave my... Jesus Christ. You are pushing me. Oh. Get out of my room. With, with... Rubbish. You don't know your class. You hey. want to marry, marry me. Yeah. Good. enough to know what I want. I don't want Oscar. I want the king. Well, the king is too old for you, okay? And you're not even good for him. Yes. He said he wants something serious. How can you even act this way? You already pissed him off. I mean, Oscar. And that's a bad sign, girl. Whatever. I told you I am no longer into fine boys. Yes, I prefer them older. I mean, oh, thank God he's even a widower. I don't have anyone to compete with. Yeah, so he's the one I want. And Are you see? Look at it this way. He's a nice man. And a king for that matter. Mandy, there is no sane woman in this world. Listen to me. There is no sane woman in this world that will do what you're about to do. Like seriously, I'm here to just guide you. You're about to make a mistake. And it's a grievous mistake, okay? I can't even comprehend it. The king over Oscar, as old as he looks, Listen, the king will not marry you, mm -hmm. but Oscar, I'm sure, will. And when that happens, <laughs> he's still the king's son, okay? The money is still there for you to enjoy, if it's just about the money. <laughs> if it's all about the money. Look, who says I'm after marriage? No. What do you want then? Allow me flow with the king and allow him spoil me with money. Oh my God. Oh. Oscar can always get another girl. I mean, I'm not cut out for this bullshit. Seriously, I don't want Oscar. It's not blood. Dad, Dad, look. Ah. Let's drop this topic now. Yeah. Let's drop it. Because obviously, I know that you can see through that. You cannot tell me that you cannot see through that. Eh? She's a gold digger. I mean, how do you explain that a young girl like that will ignore a fine young man like me and go for a daddy man like you, Dad? Money is the motive. She wants your money. Does it matter? It doesn't, matter. That. it doesn't matter, boy. This lady has made a choice, okay? So, respect that choice. <laughs> yes. Take this advice, son. Don't lean very hard on the girl, right? Else, you're gonna fall into a trap, okay? But that you already fell into the trap. <laughs> and, and I'll try to hold you back from falling. I think I'm a small boy. I'm not a small boy. I wasn't born today. Hmm? <laughs> Besides, I'm not just going to move in straight and tell her, hey, I'm going to marry you. No. I'm going to take it easy. I'm going to look at her. I'm going to study her. Okay? All is there to study. The girl wants some money. She's a simple good deal. You know what? Relax that you're not doing anything with that girl. You want a good woman? I'll find you one. Okay? I'll find you some, you know, some girl who will take care of you. My name is Ward. Welcome, Your Majesty. Greetings, my friends. Thank you. Go right. Yes, well. Get us our food now. Yes, Your Majesty. Um, Your Majesty. Ichinduka was here earlier, but he said he'll come back later. Ah! Same water first, they're already. But also, so that is your business. Sis, let me tell you. You can cry me a river for all I care. I will not marry you. So get that into your thick skull. Then get ready to leave. Yeah? You will leave this house. Also, yes! I will not go. Yes! I will not go! This is my husband's house and nobody, I repeat, nobody, not you, not your entire community put together can send me out. No leave, no transfer. Eh? I've come to stay. Yes. Eh? Mm -hmm. Is that what you think? Yes. You must leave. Huh? You must leave. 
As far as you don't want to obey me and my family, you must go. Because what are you doing here? You don't have a child for my late brother. You don't have a child for him. So what are you doing here? Is it that you agree with me or you go? That's all. I don't want to say it again. Because whatever that is in this house belongs to me. In this house and whatever that is in it are mine. Huh? So if you don't want to obey me and marry me, back and go. <laughs> liar, liar. Yes. Mm -hmm. Lies from the pit of hell. See, let me tell you. This house and everything in it belongs to my little man. You cannot deceive me. Also, you cannot deceive me. Leave that thing. You cannot deceive me. Oh, is that what you're thinking? Uh -huh. Is that what you're thinking? Mm -hmm. Have you forgotten that my brother and I were in a business partnership? Oh, you don't know? Is he alive? Is he alive? He did not tell you that one before he died. Let me tell you. Eh? Rose. <laughs> Rose. I found you. Rose, come find me. I will deal with you. Eh? I will deal with you. you. I will deal with you. I will deal with you. Come and push me out. If you don't marry me, you will. <laughs> hey, come and push me out. No, 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 are you going? Why are you going? I don't know. Come and push me out. You want to marry me? Is it by force? See, let me tell you. If I must eat fish, it has to be a big one. Not bonga fish like you. You are not my class. I will not marry you. So get that. This thing, you will not get it. Rubbish. Dad, honestly, I said what I said. That girl cannot be with you. I do not want to lose you. That girl cannot be with you. No. She can't. She's not your kind. So, um, let's look at this this way. See, you make me look and feel as if I, as if I'm not me myself again. As if I don't think I can't, not think that I can't reason out things for myself. Oscar, saw a girl mm. who likes me, mm. saw a girl I like. Okay. Why don't you let both of us rule and then maybe later you can judge. <laughs> no, Dad. I don't want to lose you. You know what? I don't want to lose you. <laughs> I nearly choked on my food. <laughs> but I'm serious, Dad. I don't want to lose you. Mm -mm. Is this girl a killer? Who knows? She's not your kind. Hey, Oscar. Sometimes I begin to think that maybe you're angry because the girl preferred me. Over you. No. Uh, well, yeah. Mm. I mean, yeah. Mm. Yeah. Yes, father. Yes. I mean, how do you explain? Listen, that look, girls like that are what we call Ron's girls. Corporate prostitutes. That's what they are. How is it even possible that she'll prefer you to a young, promising man like me? She wants your money. You need to see it, Father. You need to see it. She wants your money. Son. Dad. You know what I see when I look at you now? What do you see? Jealousy. <laughs> <laughs> you don't think I'm serious now? <laughs> Son, leave this girl alone. Come on. I tell you in the end, this girl hmm. will end up being woman and guess what a nice wife really dad mm. Uh, mm -mm. no no dad. <laughs> no no <laughs> you going for? did you just say wife for a girl just not. no come on now dad no no just eat you know what eat eat of course i'm eating my food <laughs> and i don't see you doing much of eating You're i was listening eating. to you dad <laughs> We also, what are you doing? Also, I'm talking to you. What are you doing? Are you blind? Are you blind? Can you see that I'm cultivating my family? Hmm? You entered my kitchen without my permission. I saw you. Get out. Rose. Rose, you are trying me. Also, I'm leaving my kitchen. You are trying me. You are trying me. 
You have finished mourning your husband. You have, your mourning period is over. Don't say that I'm wicked to my late brother's wife. Oh. Let them not say that I'm wicked to my late brother's wife. Oh. If I handle you, if I handle you, if I don't handle you, you you will not, you will not get yourself. Mm. I will change it for you. Wait, wait, wait. Do you want to change it for me? What's on you? You cannot do it. Do you understand? You cannot do anything. My friend, get out of my kitchen. If you're hungry, let me know. I will give you food. Get out. If I'm hungry, Madame Rose, I should tell you that I'm hungry. So if I'm hungry, I will take permission from you before I will eat. You are trying meal. <laughs> but anyway, no problems. Kudochia, let peace reign. Madame Rose, I'm hungry. Prepare my food and bring it to me at the dining room with you. <laughs> Madame Rose, I am hungry. Get me food. I'm waiting for you in your dream. You can't find it. That's so nice, Igwe. I mean, your maid must be such a wonderful cook. <laughs> Oh, you know how we ladies are, we don't eat so early. <laughs> oh sure, definitely we'll eat something. Okay. Thank you so much. <laughs> Alright, I'll be expecting your call. Thanks, honey. <laughs> Bye. Mm -hmm. Already. What? So fast. Uh -huh. Why not? Listen, <laughs> I told you that Igwe has the mind of a young guy. Hmm. See the way he's already showing me care. That is the kind of man I want. Here. <laughs> Mandy. Mm. Hey, do not cry to me. Oh. Hey, don't say I didn't want you. <laughs> How? How do you mean? <laughs> Does it look like I'm going to regret anything? Listen. The Igwe is not just rich. He is not just a king. He's wealthy. He's romantic. I mean, what more? And he is already in love with me. You know me. I cannot wait hmm. to reciprocate and give it. Yay! Hey, how juicy it could go, right? <laughs> Look, my advice is oh. you have to take things easy. Mm? Yes. No rich man is a fool. No king is a fool. Mm. I mean, they have seen it all. Okay? Mm. So if you want to last there, you have to go slow. Indeed. <laughs> but you know, unfortunately, I do not have such time. <laughs> that is how to become patient. <laughs> no, 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 no. Yeah. You know, I am all about this. Mm. So long as he's giving me money, I am okay. I don't care about heartbreak. You know, I don't even have any heart, but more of the one that we <laughs> So girl, I need us to go make something because I cannot wait to prepare myself and not raise the palace of my man. And just Mandy. Go you know, you know. Mandy. Mandy. Give it. Mandy. Mandy. <laughs> Mandy. <laughs> Oh yes, girl. You know me. You know me like when I put him down on the bed. When I get there. <laughs> oh yeah. And I just pray he does not die. <laughs> <I'm joking. laughs> you have to calm down. Like seriously, calm down, please, girl. Oh please, like for real. Let me take get myself easy. ready. You know, come show me what to wear. Something hot. I'm always here for you. Let's <laughs> go. What is it? Is it? What did I hear you say? Asombo, your food is in the kitchen. Hmm. Those you are trying me. You are trying me. 
I've been trying so hard to control my temper. Don't make me lose it too. Hmm? Don't make me lose my temper on you. Lose it. Hmm? Lose it and I will be tight. Osondo, I am not afraid of you. Stop threatening me. I'm not afraid of you. Rose, go and get that food now. Go and get that food from that kitchen. Come and pass it for me here. For me to eat. I'll react. Come on. React. Hmm. I should get the food and pass it to you here. Yeah. You will react. I should serve you as what? I don't understand. Osondo, leave me. If you're hungry, go to the kitchen and get your food. Hmm. Don't forget that your late husband's younger brother. Hmm. Who has suffered so much with my late brother to build this house? The food you are eating is my money. Give me this. You are not going to eat this. You are not going to eat this. I will do this. What is happening? I have been calling, knocking. I was no one was responding to me, not knowing that you two are here fighting. What is it? Jen, thank God you are here. What is it? Thank God you are here. Osondu wants to kill me. Osondu wants to kill me. Even you're like me. Osondu wants to kill me. Osondu, why now? Hey, please. What is why now? If you don't know what to say, shut up or you leave this place. Huh? Osondu wants to kill me. Even you're like me. Like me. She must give me this food. If you don't go and get my food. Osondu, leave here. 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 Osondu, leave Tell her or I'll push you out. Cut him. I'll push you out. Get out. Two points. Rose, what is this? Hmm. I don't believe this. Oscar Melete, you of all people. Handsome prince. Hardworking young man. What girl in this town would trade you for an old man? <laughs> uh, she chose my father over me. No, I'm not going to take this from her. It will not happen. I will do something about it. Yeah, Bella. I need to see you immediately. Where are you? What? You know what? Stay right there. All right, stay there. I'm, I'm coming to. You. Yes, I'm coming to pick you. Right now. Yeah. in the house. You would have told her you were hungry so she can give you food. God bless you, my friend. God bless you. As if I don't know that this is what you will say. I know that this is what you will say, so I'm not surprised. But go ahead and support her. So I'm too big or too small for Rose to come and serve me. I am too small for you to come and serve me in the dining, dress the dining, decorate it, come in to come and eat. Listen, I'm not the husband you have. Ta -ta -ta -ta, shut up. Close your seat, Osondo. You are not my husband and you can never be my husband. Do you understand? See, Jay, want this man, a big boy. Tell him that if he does not want my insult, he should keep this is two left leg out of my kitchen. Because the next time, <laughs> Osondo, the next time I see you in my kitchen, <laughs> Osondo, something big is about to fall on you and trust me, you're not ready for it. You are not ready for what I'm doing. Okay. See, <laughs> Osondo, Tell me this is what you want. Yeah, this is what you want. <laughs> you will never smell it. Not to talk of you. You will not smell it. Rubbish. Okay, marry. Marry, kill you then. What's on the door? I'll talk to her. Talk to her. I will. Talk 
to her. <laughs> bro, Rose, 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 Rose. You are hitting your people for me. Ah. Rose, 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 Rose. Don't worry. Let me see how you got it. No local man with local sense. What is the meaning of this? For how long will you fight with your brother in law? For as long as it takes him to know that he's not a man and should not behave like one. But I don't understand. Must you always display stupidity? Rose, Osondo I know is a man. You should accord him that respect. I will not. Yes, I won't. You don't understand. This guy seriously wants to make me his wife. And if I give him the opportunity, he will get to me. And that is not what I want. He wants to remarry you? My sister, see me. See me. Can, can you imagine that one? This is what we battled in the village when we went to remove the morning garments. The, the, the annoying part is that his father and Kingsman are in support of it. Like I don't have the right to accept or decline. Rose, you have the right to accept or decline or something. But don't you think... That is the right thing for you. Hmm? Yeah, you heard me. I mean, Osondo is a very young and vibrant man. He will take care of you. Tell me, if you do not marry Osondo, who will you? See, he's not my class. He's too local. He behaves like one old man. I can't stand him. Is that the problem? Rose, you seem to be forgetting that you do not have a child for your late husband. Hmm? Which would have been the reason for you to stay in this family. Tell me, <laughs> who will you remarry if you do not marry Osanda? Because I don't understand. You see, I don't care. I don't, okay? I, I really don't care. What I know is that I will remain in this family and have kids for my late husband from another man, not Osondu. Yes, I'm serious. Osondu is not my class. Do you know what? You're joking. Mm -mm, mm -mm. I don't want to talk about this again. Please. Rose. I don't want to talk about it. Rose. I'm really sorry about my friend's attitude. That's why I brought you here. It's fine. What, you want something to drink? Anything is fine. Alright, fine. Uh, waiter! Osando, okay? just calm down. Calm your nerves. I'm sure very soon she'll get to understand. Hmm. What I said, I have said it. You see this house? She's leaving her. She's leaving. So it's okay. She must leave because she can never refuse to do what my family have said that she would do. She must leave. If she refuses to remarry me, on a, on a, on a qua. It's okay. Stop banting words with her. Just relax. Hmm? Listen, let me tell you. You don't need to preach to her. You don't have to preach to her. This is the choice she's supposed to make. Also, I will not do. I will not choose you, so get that into your head. Do you understand? I don't care if you like, break the sky. Report to whoever you want to, it will change nothing. Yes! Rose, it's okay. Just calm down. Relax. Also, please, stop exchanging ways with her mm. when she's talking. Mm. Am I to talk? No! Also, to talk! I am talking and you're talking. Market woman, that is what you are. Market woman! No, 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 allow me! This is the man I'm supposed to marry. This one. God forbid. As for your food, it is in there. If you're hungry, go and get it. If you're not, sit down here, relax, and feel like a big man that you're not. Oh, Koromos bubble. Rubbish. Babe, I am in the room. Nonsense. Did you hear her? Did you hear her? You know how much she talks. Did you he hear her? was a man. You know women now, she can talk anyhow. She but must leave. Her. With her. She must leave. Her. I've heard. She must leave I'll this house. I'll make her understand. Don't worry. They don't have to force her. I am not forcing her. She must her. leave. 
I saw that food. Tell her to keep her food. I'm no longer interested. This is your house. You have to eat. I have money. I'm a millionaire. Eh? I'm a businessman. I am not gentle if I she know. thinks. Let me tell you, I have nowhere they say good food in this town. Correct good food with big meat. Don't worry. Darling. Don't worry. Is it all right? Hmm? No problem. Rose. <laughs> Listen, Bella, I don't want Mandy for my father, okay? What my father needs is a woman, not a girl, a woman that would take care of him. He's not getting any younger, he's not a spring chicken. My father needs a wife, not Mandy, not her kind. Really? Yes. Interesting. Now, listen, I need you to do something for me, but I need you to keep it between you and I. All right, Mandy does not have to know about it. Can you get me another lady? Someone really beautiful and classy. Someone I can introduce to my father. Someone that can catch my father's attention. I want to create some kind of distraction in my father's head. I don't want Mandy to get close to my father. Do you get where I'm going with this? I understand you perfectly, but how soon do we need this baby? Like yesterday, like right now. We have to move fast. I don't want my father to get intimate with Mandy. Yes. It's going to make things more complicated. Do you know someone we can talk to? In that case, I think I know someone I can actually call. Okay. My friend Laura. Laura, okay. She's actually very, very cute and sexy. She's in this town? Yeah, she's sexy in this town. So what are you waiting for? Call her. Come on now. Okay. Come on now, Bella. Do this for me. You know I'll take care of you, right? I know. In that case, I'll just call her right away. Please. Oh, we don't it's have time. Okay, right. darling. I'll follow it. Mm. Okay. Yeah. Come on. Hey, come down. Okay. Yeah. Which khaki? Asandu, you can't use the car because I want to make use of it. Give me the khaki. Yeah. What is the meaning of this? You're pushing me to the wall, oh. Asandu. Yeah? Asandu. Asandu, don't look for my trouble. Don't look for my trouble, I'm warning you. See, this is my husband's car. And I want to make use of it later in the day. You can go and get yours at the mechanic where you left it. Let me have the key. I want to use this car to go somewhere and eat food. And I say you cannot use it. Give me the key. Hmm. You are looking for my trouble. Oh, Sandu, give me the key. You are looking for my trouble. Stop wasting my time. Give me the key. Rose. I'm not a dead to man, though. I'm not a dead to man. This is my business. This is my business. I will change it for you. Oh, Sandu, this is not my business. Give me the key. Give me the key, I beg. Rose, what is wrong with you? What is all this? Why are you acting so troublesome? Huh? Yes. Please. I am begging you, don't even talk to me, okay? Don't talk to me! What am I even saying? We are done talking. Go inside. Really? Yes. Oh well, I'm even sorry to talk to you, to convince you. Thank you. We are going inside. Come and talk to her. Asandu, give me the key. Uh, Asandu! Rose. Asandu! I'm not a gentleman. I know you're not a gentleman and that is not my uh, business. Give me the key. See, Asandu, let me tell you. I know you want to frustrate me in my own house. But it will not work for you. It will not work for you. You see this car? It is my husband's car. If you want to go out, make use of the public transport. If you cannot, drop to your destination. As for this car, it's not going anywhere. Let me have the key. God. Leave God, God and give me the key. God, you just balance and you're watching her pushing me to the wall. Huh? By the time I get to the wall, Enter the I, will wall. Do, I will do my mind. Do, do what? Also, you cannot do, do anything. Mind. You cannot do anything. Let me tell you, you cannot do anything. Leave that thing. Give me the key. Rose. Osondo, stop wasting my time. Rose. Rose. Osondo. No problem. Shameless man. No, no, no. Come and drive the key with a woman. You don't have shame. Go go and carry your car at the mechanic shop where you left it. It's yours. Come and drive. Rubbish.
Your Majesty. Mm. Sorry to disturb you. There's a lady here I want to see you. She said her name is Mend. What's name? Mend. Bring her in. Okay, your Majesty. <laughs> Look at me first. <laughs> Look at me. Look at me. Forget the house. Look oh. at me. Look at me. <laughs> Admire me. <laughs> you look good. You're welcome. Thank you. Yes. Thank you. Hey, where is this boy? Come on. How yeah. have you been? Very good. Very good. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Now, sit down. Oh. Yes. Oh. Yeah, yeah, you're welcome. Yes. <laughs> so, what do we offer you? Um, water. What I will do. Like I said over the phone, mm. I'm watching my weight. <laughs> water? Yes, water. Ordinary water. Yes. <laughs> Are you there? Um. Hey, you heard her. Come on, get get the let them get water for her. Ah, oh. Andy. Igwe. Mm. Thank you. <laughs> no vex. When you came, I was in the middle of a fight with that fool. <laughs> but girl. The way you're going about all this is wrong. What is wrong about it? I mean, I don't see anything wrong with that guy. Babe, you should consider yourself lucky that he finds you interesting. Don't mm -hmm. you think? Mm hmm. Like, really? Mm hmm. <laughs> as a fine boy, but as a governor son that he is. <laughs> Babe, please. <laughs> Babe, not be so. I know very well how much you love your late husband, that you wish not to leave the family and marry elsewhere, in as much as you're still very young. But if you ask me, I will tell you that if he comes out now and asks you to remarry, babe, he will tell you to marry his younger brother. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. My husband can never advise me to marry his brother. Can't you see that this guy is too loud and he's not even coordinated? Please, I can't do that. That is where you're making a mistake. Yeah. That is where you're making a mistake, girl. Get him, change him the way you want him to be. This guy has respected you so much to have given you up to one year. Come on, girl, that guy is not bad. Mm. I wish I'm the one wearing your shoes. Seriously, I would just accept him one touch. But you're not in my shoes. I know. Can we talk about something else, please? If you wish. Oh, thank you. What you take me for? A long life of what? Papa, seriously, I do not want you to misunderstand this. Okay? Think about it, darling. It brings a lot to gain. Okay? You have to play this game with me. Please? If you were not my friend right now, I would have walked out on you. What is wrong with you? Can you listen to yourself? Listen, if we're talking about this guy in question, you will be here preaching to me. He's the one I want. Can't you see how cute he is? And he's rich as well. What would I be doing with his father? I am not interested. I am interested in him. Okay. So, what would you want me to tell him now? That I'm crushing on him? What? Yes, tell him I said I'm crushing on him. Yes, he's the one I want, like I said. <sighs> Listen, if you can do it, then I will. Do you want to or I should? Huh? Uh, never mind. I'm going. Let's go. Uh, 
my goodness, this girl is spoiling my game. Igwe, I'm an adult. I know exactly what I want. And that's you. So can we forget about your son's issue? Well said. As a matter of fact, my son has forgotten all about that. Hmm? Good. Yes, but what surprises me is this, Mandy. How can a young, dashing, pretty girl like you prefer an old man like me over a young, handsome, very promising, well brought up prince? How? Oh. <laughs> Igwe. I learned something from my late mother. Mm. Mothers. You see, men like you will always tolerate me. No matter how naughty or arrogant I may get. So that is what I want. I don't want to be with a young rich man who I will have to keep fighting for his attention away from other women. Mm. So do you get me now? In a manner of speaking, but... Mm -hmm. The young man in question is, is young, is dashing, is handsome, and is well brought up. And to cap it, he's a prince. Fine, I totally understand you, but... I mean, let's forget about it. My king. The food is ready. All right. Thank you. Yes. So, my king, why don't we go to your room so that I can give you a proper body sound? Mandy Massage You see I I would very much like To indulge In relaxing And The body massage Especially from you <laughs> Yes but I want you to see this relationship that's building. This budding relationship between us. I want you to look beyond massage, frills, frills, and fun, including all those frivolities of the young age. Look beyond all that. I need something more serious from you. Do you understand me? Perfectly. Sure. No problem. Good. So, <laughs> shall we go and eat? <laughs> <laughs> That was pretty interesting, I tell you. It's okay. Um, Oscar, I would like to take my leave now so you and Bella can get to know yourselves better. Okay. Yes. Come here. Thank you so much. Thank That's you. it. You know I owe you one, right? I know. <laughs> All right. Um, take care of you now. Whatever happens, I'll call you. Okay. Yeah. Laura. Okay, Boo Boo. I'll come right. see you soon, okay? Okay. You take right. care. Yeah. Bye. Bye. Why are you looking at me like that? I admire you. 
Oh, really? Yes. <laughs> but you were going to pass me on to your dad. Ah, no, you won't understand. Listen, um, it got a bit complicated at some point. You won't understand. I'll put you in the clear later. But for now, I just want you to know that you're a beautiful woman. I am my spec. Thank you. And I like you too. Mm. Mm -hmm. So why don't you tell me about this handsome guy sitting in the front of me? <laughs> I see you want this conversation to take a different turn. I'm ready. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I like you. I like you too. You're my kind too. Correct. Seriously, mm. you've done a wonderful thing by inviting me over. I can say that again. I see how God works in different ways. No, right? How you see this <sighs> life is so so funny. You can never tell where your ship will just sail from. I swear. I see I owe you my life. This guy is the perfect definition of a guy I want in my life. And to crown it all, I'm also his spec. You uh -huh. need to see the way we were talking like it was not the first time we were meeting. The chemistry, everything. Oh God. Oh my It goodness. was so cute. Oh God, I'm so happy for you. Hi. Look at you. Mm -hmm. See, you have to settle me. Huh. Settle you qua. Girl, I say I owe you my life. Do you know what it is for a rich man like that to fall in love with me? Igwe son for that matter. Ha. Girl, no. What be smart thing you do? I'm happy. In fact, if I leave here and I force I'm going to the house, I'm going to serious fasting and prayer. <laughs> to cast any demon that wants to spoil this. I'm not joking, girl. <laughs> oh my goodness. Come on. Look at you, my darling. Look at the smile on your face. You're obviously so happy. And I'm happy for you too. Okay? You guys are just so lucky. I just seem to be the unlucky one amongst you. Yeah. See, Mandy. She just ended up with his father today. And you. But me, I just. I'm just the same person that directs my friends to their destinations. Girl, stop, Joe. It's not like that. I'm thankful to you, Abed. Mm. <laughs> Thank you, Steve. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> Hello, son. Good evening, Dad. Hello, son. Hi, Mandy. Oscar. Mandy is here. <laughs> Hi. Father, I'll be inside. Yeah. I thought. I thought you said he's no longer angry. Um, go ahead. Use one of the cars and drop Mandy. Yes, sir. Yes. Mandy, Mandy, come on. Let him drop you. Don't worry about that. I'll talk with my son. Okay. Come on. Let him drop you. Okay. Bye. <laughs> come here. <laughs> Take care. I'll see you, okay? All right. See you. All right.
like seriously? She chose the dad over the son? My sister. <laughs> she did though. Even though I'm just waiting for her to come back so that I can interview her and know her stand. Because for all we know, this might just be a fling with the Igwe. Even though Oscar mentioned that the Igwe wants a wife. Wife? Yes. It can't be that girl, Mandy. That girl will mess things up for you and you know. You know, by the time she goes there and starts showing her hungry nature and love for money, ha, I'm sure the Igwe will just throw her out of the house. Hmm. What? Nora. But what if it finally becomes real that she marries the Igwe? It means the two of you are now co-wives. Abeg, 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 what kind of talk is that? It's never going to happen. I'm going there. Yeah. I'm just thinking ahead of time. Oh. Babe, I'll see you tomorrow. This conversation is very important now. It's okay. Okay, okay. <coughs> Alright now. I'll see you down. Okay, Alright, take care of yourself. Be okay. good, okay? Sure, sure. Hello, how are you doing? Oh boy. Alright, darling. See ya. Take care. Sure, bye. Bye. Hmm. Hmm. Bella. Hey. See your life. Try. <laughs> Anyways, no problem. Let Oscar just come and give me whatever he wants to give me. Let me just fix myself. Ha! Rape you? How can I rape you? How can I rape a woman that belongs to you? I don't belong to you. Also, do I don't belong to you? I am warning you for the last time. Also, do avoid me. Avoid me, oh! Who's bad me? Also, do stay away from me. Rose, 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 Rose. Why do you hate me so much? Yeah? What is all this? I think Papa has to come to city. Mm -mm. Papa, you must come to city to witness this. You must see this and you must judge it. Never. Papa must come to this city so that you know. Eh?
Achalu raya power, achalu 